Hello and welcome to Module 6, Flexibility and Improvements. My name is Brian Shannon and I'm a Product Manager with the Autodesk Vault family of products. This module is going to cover uh, enhancements uh, that we've made to the product that were driven by customers, by, by resellers, and talk about the flexibility of Autodesk Vault as a data management solution. So we're going to cover some of the new file management and file resolution enhancements that, that we've made. Uh, we'll revisit uh, the job server, something that we took a look at a little bit earlier in enabling. We're going to take a, a deep dive into what that is. Uh, we're going to take a look at some item master workflow improvements, um, some new improvements in data loading, and we'll take a look at the ability to export items and, uh, and integrate with upstream systems. So first of all, the third tier to our, uh, our series here is flexibility. So these are really customer-driven enhancements and improvements that we've made to the product. So the first one is uh, covering file management improvements. Uh, the, there's a uh, vault has always understood with an inventor file or an AutoCAD file that there are relationships and oftentimes that file interdependency if you want to move or rename or um, basically restructure files vault was there to go in and fix everything for you. Um, it would take it all out to a location, fix it up, and check it back in. And what we found with is uh, that was oftentimes over-constrained, or if uh, files were released or files weren't uh, accessible, this would be a non-operation. And significant changes have been made inside of Vault 2012 to speed up the improvements in the move and file, move file and rename file uh, specifically. Um, we uh, change the uh, the relationship repair basically made uh, made you able to change and move things around files around inside a vault without the penalty of having to wait while vault went and fixed everything up and created a version for you we'll put that off until the next time you open it up in inventor or in AutoCAD and this removes restrictions and allows uh, a, a new paradigm of flexibility in that you can restructure, given that you have the rights to do it, you can restructure uh, without being constrained by um, security or the files checked out to somebody else or it's released and things. So the, the CAD add-in knows the origin. The CAD add-in will ask Vault, well, where are the files? And the files will open up appropriately without the resolve link uh, or the find file dialog box. And coming up, we're going to actually take a look at a vignette that exposes this and talks about it. And uh, you'll see uh, a contrast between uh, Vault 2012, which we have, and uh, a prior release of Vault when it comes to uh, moving files and renaming files.